Firstly, how does it feel to have your film a big London premiere? It, 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 I'm like, a, it's a kid at Christmas. I mean, like, uh, I never thought I'd have a Leicester Square premiere for my movie. It's crazy. I'm done. I can quit now. I've made yeah. it. It's on the, a tick off the bucket list. <laughs> no, it's amazing to uh, to show the film at Fright Fest. Uh, it's an amazing festival. I've watched it for, you know, I've seen it for many years. And it's a great festival that embraces genre film. There's not a lot out there that embrace genre. And, uh, and, and I think it's great that we do that. And it's brilliant to be able to launch the film here with the fans of the genre. And it's great to be kind of, you know, embracing by this family uh, in order to launch our film. It's quite weird. Okay. It's quite surreal being here, to be very honest. <laughs> um, if you could just explain a little bit about the film, because it's not just one for horror lovers, it's all film lovers, because it's got a cinema theme to it. Yeah. Uh, you always do such a great job <laughs> giving your yeah, rotate. Yeah, I know. Uh, <laughs> so, yeah, the last showing is uh, set in a multiplex cinema, and uh, basically it's about a projectionist that's made redundant. He's given his life to movies, and uh, because film is changing, we don't need projectionists anymore. Everything's digital, and everything's at the press, you know, the press of a button. So he's made to work the popcorn counter, uh, and uh, obviously that is uh, being that demotion kind of makes him snap, and he real and he thinks like, well, if I can't show the films, I might as well learn how to make them. So he decides. To, an act of crazy revenge to trap a random couple inside a cinema overnight and use all the cameras that he has available to him, the CCTV, his own cameras that he's planted, to create his own horror film. Um, and uh, what that comes is that the film's actually a meta-horror. You know, it's not gory, it's not bloody, but it's more psychological. It, it more comments on the way film is changing and the way the genre is changing. And we're really trying to make a film that doesn't just appeal to the hardcore horror fans, uh, that hopefully there's something in there for everybody and uh, yeah and we'll, we'll see if that works. <laughs>